Hi, all my business owners out there. If you haven't been to my channel before, I am Gisela from Infinite Book Equity, and I'm here to empower small business owners to obtain the knowledge to be able to make the best future decision or investment for their business. Today, we're going to speak about something that probably is focused towards my bookkeepers out there, which is the discovery call. I have seen in a lot of the groupers that I have joined that many asked, what should you ask during a discovery call? So this is, of course, when you're getting to know the client and trying to determine if this is going to be a good relationship. At the end of the day, every relationship should be based on if you guys can work together, right? And within that discovery call is when you would be able to determine that. Within a discovery call, you have to obtain certain general information like this company name, what type of entity the business is, or what type of accounting software are they are they using. But of course, after that general information, there are other details that you would need to know to determine if this is a project that you can take on or that you should take on or something that's going to work between you guys, right? So I will link down a document that I use on questions that would be a good idea on having answered during this discovery call. But what I want to address today is how do you get those questions asked? Because if I think about it myself as a business owner, I wouldn't want to go to a discovery call where all I'm doing is being asked a list of questions and that's it. And many clients feel anxious about showing that information because they're scared that they might have a mess going on or for whatever reason. Therefore, you don't want to just sit there and have to answer a whole bunch of questions. It's already nerve wracking. You don't, you're not going in there to take a test, right? What I, I have discovered is the best way to obtain that information is to literally just sit there and listen. That is the best way to get that information from your client. Definitely get the basics, as I mentioned before, but after that, just ask the client, what is going on? What is it that they need your help in? Or what's going on in their business? And from there, just let them speak. You just sit there and you listen. From everything that the client tells you that's going on with the business, you are going to be able to answer all the questions in my discovery template. It's exactly the way that I do it. I ask them the basics and then from there, I ask them to tell me about their business. As I'm listening, of course, paying attention to the client because at the end of the day, the client wants to feel like you are focusing on them. While you are listening to what they are telling you, you are jotting down notes on the different questions that you have that you need answered. And then from there, when the client is done detailing to you what is going on in their business, I can assure you that most or all questions will be answered at the end of that conversation. And from there, you can make the decision on if this is going to work out for you and of course for the client. Because all we want to do as bookkeepers is being able to give the best services to our clients as best as possible. And of course, sometimes certain relationships are just not going to work and that's just life. You make that decision and then you go on to the next step, with of, which is of course, as a bookkeeper, you know your it's the proposal and everything else. And I hope that from this you have gotten, the best thing you can do during a discovery call is to just listen to your client. It's about your client and it always will be. You listen to them and let them tell you what is going on. What are they needing assistance with? What do they need your services for? And they will be able to do this just by talking about their business. And I will link the document that I use for my discovery call. So I hope that this video has been helpful. I hope that it is able to guide you in your discovery call. So please subscribe to my channel, hit a like for the video, and I will see you next week.